What's up guys, your boy Jet here, or Independent Montage, or Harrison, whatever you want to call me, I personally do not care, but today I'm going to be giving you guys a quick, easy tutorial on muffled sound, uh, pretty cool, pretty cool, you can do it with feeds, but um, today we're just going to be working with audio, this has nothing to do with video, so um, to, we're going to be using E-double, Be a King, that's the song that we're using, and let's hear what this sounds like, uh, we'll start around right there, now we'll start right here. Turn it up a bit for you guys. Alright, just a regular song, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to make a muffled sound. It kind of, well, it does lower the sound. It does lower the volume, but that's not all it does because there is a huge difference. Okay, so... Um, we're gonna find where we want to muffle the sound, okay? So, uh, I'll put a marker when I start to muffle. M is for marker. Okay, uh, so we're just gonna start it right here and end it right here, okay? So now I'm going to cut the video, S is to cut. And then cut the video right here, S is to cut. So... Now we can delete these markers. We don't need these anymore. Okay, so now we have this part. This is the part that we want to muffle. Something about his mama telling him something, okay? And so, uh, right here, um, right there, okay? You can see event FX. It's pretty tiny, but that's what we want to click on. And it comes up with a bunch of stuff. It uh, might look confusing, but it really isn't. We want to click on track EQ. What track EQ does, it is, it is ac EQ actually stands for equalizer, and it just messes with the volume. And that, yeah, that's basically what it is. So, um, sorry, I'm texting. So, uh, yeah, so I'm going to click on that. Press OK. All right, so now we have this. Um, yeah, this is what it should look like for you guys. I have a preset for the muffled. So this is just copy these settings down. Frequency, this is for marker one or whatever one. Frequency 366, gain, negative INF, roll off 12. And we want this on high shelf. Enable it, obviously. Two, we want this, well, we want the frequency at 300, gain at zero, and bandwidth at one. And we want this on band. Okay, three. We want frequency at 1,000, gain at zero, and bandwidth at one. And then we want band on this one. And then for number four, we want frequency at 5,000, gain on zero, and roll off on 12. And we want this one on high shelf. Okay, so we obviously want to enable all these, make sure they're all enabled. And then you can come up here. Type a preset name and then press save so you'll always have it and you don't have to come back to this tutorial. So, now we have our muffled sound and that was pretty simple guys. I don't, that literally only took about uh, 10 seconds. So, uh, let's now hear the original. Let's hear the original then I'll show you guys the uh, muffled. Okay, oops, hold on. Answer audio, paste, All right, that's good. Sorry, I'm using one hand. It's a bit hard. That's what she said. Um, okay, so this right here, let's hear the original. Okay, so let's hear it one more time because I messed with the audio a bit. Alright, here we go. Alright, that's the original. Now let's hear what the muffled sounds like. See, there's a major difference. It sounds, and see, even if I were to turn this down really low, even if I were to turn the original down really low, it doesn't, it doesn't sound good. Like, at all. The muffled sounds much better. So yeah, you guys can do this effect on feeds, trick shots, whatever you want, really. Really cool effect, really useful. Um, 
it might be overused sometimes, but yeah, don't use it too much because people wouldn't like it too much. Use it like once or twice, twice the most on any edit. And yeah, guys, one thing you guys for watching. Take it easy. Peace. I'm out.